Hello and welcome uh, welcome. Uh, we are a little bit late because Hello. Uh, and welcome uh, welcome. Uh, we are a little bit late because uh, oh I had my voice again. I have not used get used to this uh, yet. Uh, <laughs> the setup with Nordic uh, Gordon, uh, sorry. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, <coughs> hello again. And uh, we are a little bit late because uh, we were eating a little bit late. Sorry about that. Yeah, yeah. Um, sorry about that. <coughs> uh, I just created the like uh, starting soon screen also for this occasion because like, <laughs> we didn't have anything yet uh, set up. <coughs> uh, but yeah, now we're here. So uh, without further ado, uh, let's go to the topic, uh, which is. Uh, yeah belief on influence and thickness and I guess you can introduce uh, the topic yeah yeah I will <clears throat> well yeah you need to have belief on it Dave yeah let's say Dave is asking belief on yeah mm. uh, it is a theo theology stream kind of I would rather say it is a uh, yeah this is a, a lecture about uh, oh yeah it should be in I'm sorry Oh, yeah, I, yeah okay. I just copied what uh, Jeff uh, wrote, and I, I'm not... Okay, sorry, yeah, like that, that yeah, much, that, yeah, that much uh, uh, of English speaker, so... <laughs> yeah, okay, I'm in. sorry. Okay, then, uh, yeah, let's turn it to Ian, sorry. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, all right. But, uh, yeah, let's say, um, yeah, no, yeah, let's, uh, yeah, let's, uh, yeah, let's, uh, let's start now. Uh, I'm not sure, uh, yeah, let's say, how many you have actually experienced uh, about uh, this kind of uh, situations in real life. I will start with some real life situation here. Let's, like uh, you are, let's say, imagine I just made up a story, let's say, in my preparation for this lecture. Mm -hmm. um, I'm a job seeker. I will need to find a job. And one day I went to a job interview. Okay. And then after I sit down there, I happen to see, huh, okay, so the one who is gonna interview me, and uh, yeah, let's say one of them, I know him. He's a Go player. I have played against him actually so many times, for example, in uh, Kaisla, yeah, let's say in, uh, yeah, in Helsinki Go Club. And I say, huh, okay, so it's you, okay, how are you doing? Okay, so it's uh, so whole long, we, we didn't talk and meet, blah, 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 blah. Okay, and then we did the procedure, we had the interview, so we kind of know probably yeah that is, this is start and this is the end already. So because of this part, and if the interview goes in general smoothly without any problem, I guess it's no surprising in the end I got accepted, I got the job. Yeah. Yeah, I guess that's uh, normal, right? Okay, and how did I get the job? First, uh, definitely because I'm qualified for the job. If I'm not qualified for the job, it doesn't matter. Even if I know him and uh, in the interview, he find out, okay, yeah, he cannot really do it. I will not going to be accepted. But then I believe there are some other job seekers who, who want to get this job. They are qualified too. So why me? Mm. Yeah, I guess it's a pretty simple answer. Yeah, let's say I know the boss and uh, we are... Yeah, we, we, we know each other in Go. We have played Go before. So mm. this is something we say in real life, we say this is like religious. Yeah, yeah so you have, yeah, you, you, let's say there, there's, some, there's some, some, something connected between you and the boss, so you get the job. Yeah, and this... Yeah. Actually, actually, like just short, short uh, funny story. I got my job uh, when mm -hmm. I'm working now because of Go. Also, like uh, <laughs> my, my my boss knew that I'm uh, like knew, knew the game. He didn't know the rules that much, but he knew that it's a very hard game and like uh, you have to like actually like uh, learn a lot to be like four done. Uh, <laughs> so um, I got the job mainly because of that one because I didn't have any work experience. I just had like. Uh, a master's degree so like uh, that that is not uh, nothing on uh, information technology like field so yeah like, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah 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 right yeah. so uh yeah so here this is kind of uh, religious actually here yeah let's say uh, auntie is asking how, how this is re related well actually i'm choosing something probably to us that is relatively acceptable to actually give an example because this kind of relations uh, this kind of relations and so you get the job this exists also in our society. Hmm. And if, for example, I can actually give something, let's say, probably it's harder to accept, and then I will actually talk about a corruption. Right? So, for example, yeah, this can easily happen. Like, uh, um, I'm an employee in a company, and uh, I mess something up. 
And uh, so I have a colleague, we, we did this case together and we both messed this thing up, this case. And so basically, let's say, uh, the head of, uh, of me in this uh, uh, apartment, he is not very happy about it. But you know what? Uh, the, let's say the head of this entire company, uh, he's my father. He's my half-father. Then what happens next? Then I can easily imagine when we went to the, uh, let's say, our, our leader of this, uh, yeah, of, uh, yeah, of, of our, uh, this uh, part, and uh, then he will come to me and pat my shoulder, careful next time, go. Mm -hmm. And then I leave, and to the other guy said, what the hell you have done? You are fired. Mm -hmm. That will be corruption, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that will be corruption, and there's something probably you could put, yeah, some corruption, you can hardly even accept that I'm not going to talk about that anymore. And I want to tell you, that is the influence and sickness. Mm, mm, yeah. That is influence and sickness in Go. So, so in Go, let's say, uh, when we talk about them, what does it mean? What, when we talk about influence and sickness, what, uh, yeah, what does it mean? It means... Uh, you have somebody or something to rely on that allows you to do something that normally you cannot do. Mm, mm. That is exactly the point here. Yeah. That is exactly the point here. And uh, I know that too many of uh, us, uh, let's say go players, and we are nice people, and uh, we basically say, yeah, like, uh, I know that I'm son of the boss, but I should follow the rule too, right? How can I be special? That will be corruption. I guess many people, even in real life, you are thinking that way. And then on the go board, you do the same thing. I want to tell you, in that case, that there's then, then let's say to you, to use influence and thickness will be difficult. Yeah, it will be very difficult, and uh, you have to be crafted on the go board. <laughs> <laughs> you have, you, you don't have a choice here. I hope you understand this. Yeah, yeah. Once uh, you understand this, and then. Let's say in Asia, basically people basically people basically say, you have some 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 connection, you have some relationship, and you are not using it. You're stupid. Mm. Yeah, like remember in China when I'm seeking for a job, my let's say basically people knows uh, people knows me around me. They all speak to me like that. So mm. basically they say, if you are not using it, you are stupid. And so they basically say, you use it. That's the right thing to do. I'm just saying that is why to Asian, this is something natural. Mm. Okay, remember, you need to do something that normally you wouldn't do. You, that can actually help you to go over the line. And so, of course, here, when it comes to this, uh, when we come to how to use the influence and sickness, you need to actually, re yeah, you need to do some reading. But you know here, please believe you can do this, and you can actually rely on this to do something that you normally you cannot do. There, you're going to see the value of influence and sickness. Okay, this is uh, my start. I hope this is understandable. Yeah. <laughs> I have to give some real life. Uh, yeah, 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 no, uh, uh, as we uh, mentioned yesterday, uh, that like uh, on GoBoard you don't have moral like uh, like we do in real life. So uh, uh, if if you are corrupted or something, that doesn't necessarily mean that you are evil or anything. It, yeah. It, it, it's okay on GoBoard. Uh, on real life, yeah. don't don't do those things. But like uh, on GoBoard, uh, if you have to do those, then you have to do those. <laughs> uh, on the GoBoard, let's say not only you have to do those, you have to do that. Yeah, Miko said. Uh, Miko said in that way, you need to actually overcome the moral barrier and actually be proud of it. Mm -hmm. You need to be proud of it because that's the right thing to do. I want to tell you, let's say. Real life and a go board. In this sense, you should you have to consider that as completely two different societies. It's basically Europe and Asia. Let's say <laughs> yeah, it's, yeah. it's two things. Yeah, two things completely different. When you have many of you have traveled to Asia, do you think that's the same? It's just a different. Yeah, and the, yeah, the way people living there is also different. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, but now let's come back to go. And I, this is something I want you to think towards that direction. Okay, and of course, let's say, uh, when we come to the Go examples, when we say, how much I can <laughs> corrupt, or let's say, I can abuse mm. this kind of religions, or the power I have, how much? 
Uh, normally, for example, we say in at our level game, there's a easily good opportunity you can actually abuse a lot. And uh, yeah, later you're gonna see some uh, some of the examples. When it comes to the pro games, pros are cautious. Pros wouldn't easily give you yeah such an opportunity that you can actually directly get a lot and directly win the game. That normally wouldn't happen. That requires you to be able to squeeze it. Squeeze mm. it. So basically, it is like uh, um, I'm uh, basically a leader of the local community. Okay, so it's let's say I'm, I have some power, but not too much. Mm. And then in Asia, what are we going to do? I will actually use my power taking every single opportunity possible to actually get myself some income. Not too much, but some. Mm. And every single opportunity. Yeah. And that is basically the pro way to squeeze. Just imagine you have an order on your hand, you squeeze the joys, and then that is basically how you get the orange joys. Yeah, otherwise you wouldn't. You mm. need to squeeze. Yeah. You can't say, how can I do like that? How can I treat him like that? Then you can't get anything. Okay, I guess this is understandable. Now let's come to the first example. No, Oscar said something uh, uh, about Moyos. Uh, that it's uh, the wholesome part of it is that the, the stones have to work together, but uh, that's uh, not completely true because, like uh, in Moyo plan, you sometimes have to sacrifice like families for the greater good to, for the for the moyo for example yesterday we had like uh, the like mm. black should have uh, like sacrificed uh one part uh to like actually work together with the moyo but like uh black didn't in that game and the moyo didn't finally work out so yeah, yeah. Uh, it's, sometimes it's not so wholesome you know, sometimes you have to sacrifice families for for the greater good <laughs> yeah because uh, yeah that is uh, something slightly different when yeah that is actually about the yesterday we were talking about dictatorship and its the regime how it survives so yeah. basically it doesn't really allow any individualism including if that's your family if uh, he's actually hurting the whole regime he cannot coexist with the regime yeah, that is basically the case here. But okay, here uh, it is slightly different from uh, what we are talking about here because yeah, we have mentioned uh, yeah yesterday we were talking about the whole rhythm and today we are just talking about part. Yeah, it doesn't have to come to a moyo. So right. we come to then the fir the fir very first example. <gasps> mm. So okay, I will first come here. Yep. And uh, yeah, so uh, yeah, Oscar, we're gonna look, yeah see this this is something I'm familiar with, but doesn't matter. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, in the game, Black has just played the Kema and run this group out. And then White, you can see White is in general in the attacking gesture. I probably should pass a few moves. So here, White played Ogema to attack Black. Mm -hmm. And Black press, White Nobby. Black Kema to get out. And White is still in the mood of oh, I'm attacking. So in the game, White played the Kema here. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So, question is what Black should do here? Chat, what is your idea? Yeah, what Black should do here? And uh, remember here, yeah, if you if you follow our topic today, I guess the following moves uh, will not gonna be difficult to find. And uh, this is Oscar's game against uh, Tangi in Yes, yes. Uh, Grenoble, twenty twenty. Yeah, yeah. So this is what was on February. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So yeah, um, Black's plan. What to do? Yeah, what Black should do here? Let's say yeah, as your opinion, what Black should do here? White forgot about his own weak group. So, can you uh, go a little mm -hmm. bit further from that idea? Yeah, we need to come to something more specific. Yeah, uh, I wanna do G twelve, but wonder if it if first something like L twelve. Ah, oh, okay. So three twelve, but first like L twelve. Uh, L twelve so looks uh, <laughs> pretty interesting. Yeah, yeah. I've been tempted to ignore White's move and try to attack White, but I don't mm -hmm. have a great plan yet. Uh, L thirteen, perhaps. Mm -hmm. 
Mm. Okay, so uh, many people are uh, targeting white here and like uh, thinking about some move around here, I guess. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, sure. Okay. Uh, maybe, uh, yeah, so I'm not sure if I should already start talking about it. But okay, yeah, I, I probably should. Uh, let's uh, probably wait like uh, a few seconds. Okay, okay, sure. Yeah, I will wait a little bit. Mm. Uh, any other plans? Some some specifics because like uh, mm. uh, if you just say like maybe perhaps this one I guess uh, you're still reading uh, the situation out so yeah yeah and I think ignore is a good idea since K sixteen still don't have an I mm. K sixteen uh huh mm. okay yeah yeah okay. Mm. Cut or attack hole? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. That is basically that, that, that is a good tip. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, the choices for that. Mm. You could also just jump out and be patient. Uh, ignore G if you're 14. I got a great. Uh, I got a threat against uh, C15. Yeah, yeah. So, like, uh, ignoring this one and, and doing. Like, yeah, okay, so we have the options to, to just jump out, like uh, uh, Yakako said. And then we have some mm -hmm. kind of moves here, like a uh, few people said already. Yes, leaning attack. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I saw a few of Oscar's recent Moyo game also, right? It's incredibly patient. <laughs> uh. Patience doesn't okay. sound good. If white gets M12 or something, white will be stronger. Okay, I guess okay. it's my yeah, turn. To... Yeah, yeah, yeah. There was some yeah. ideas, so like, go ahead. Okay, yeah, let's say it's probably my turn to interfere here. Okay, first, uh, let's find out uh, who, where is our relations. Okay? Mm -hmm. So, yeah, here, I hope you notice when black has such this kind of a war. This here, what is the exchange basically? The exchange is actually with them. So for to get that, black already has paid territory there. Yeah. Okay, and so for there, black has the influence. And uh, now it is the time, let's say, uh, we actually think about how to actually get our investment back. Mm. Yeah. And then what happens to have an uh, Ogema ship there in the center? I guess it is so natural we start with this one, just as some of you have mentioned, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So here, yeah, I would, uh, I, yeah. So to me, yeah, here, they, yeah, this is the this is right way because here, yeah, we have the relations there to rely on. Let's just do it because we can. And what is saying, what was saying, I'm attacking you, and uh, yeah, we need to show him that's not true. Yeah. Yeah. So here, yeah, let's say I, I will just show what happens next in the game. So what I did some preparation in the game while keep here. Yep. Okay. And uh, then push, honey. And uh, then black put here. So to attack. You can see here, it is more like white is actually under attacking, right? Yeah. 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 White is actually under attacking here. And so uh, black played pretty straightforward. So here, yeah, just attack and no be here. And uh, I think black next move is, uh, yeah, he calls me. Yeah. So to get the right shape. Okay, not like what we're gonna die inside, but what we will need to actually, in a pretty difficult way, to seek for twice inside. And then the outside two stones will be isolated. So this is, yeah, from here on, it is more like a black is attacking. It's not like white is actually attacking black. Mm -hmm. And, uh, okay, but I want to actually come back here. Let's come back here. So this is the black starting move, and some of our viewers here has already mentioned about this. It's kind of obvious now. I mean, how can black do this? Will you say, okay, I change the circumstances. Mm. So uh, if it comes to, uh, sorry, I probably should do like this. Uh, probably, okay, yeah, this is hard. I, I, I at least yeah. need to maintain this stone, right? Yeah, yeah. Do you think we can do it like this? <laughs> yeah. You know, the, you, here, so you, so, you see, so you see the difference, I'm just saying. Here, basically, 
who is the one we know in the company? I'm sorry, we don't know anyone. Then probably you'd better be very careful to prepare for your for your job interview. You can't just say, let's just talk and have some fun and later let's play a go and play some <laughs> or let's food, let's have a drink in the bar and then I get the job. Be careful. Yeah. You can't just do whatever. Yeah. So here, let's say, how can black actually do in that extreme way to actually directly cut that thing off? Because black has the relations there to rely on, and that's important. And once again, I want to repeat what I have mentioned earlier. To Asian, if you have the relations, yeah, you have the relationship to rely on, and you are not using it, you're stupid. Okay, so please use it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, this is yeah. I I gave this example at the first because I guess this is the probably an example that is not so difficult to most of you. Yeah. Okay. So this one is a, a relatively easy one because this one we can actually do something pretty direct. Yeah. Okay. Gradually, it wouldn't be that simple. <laughs> yeah, it will be so, there. It come to some harder examples. Okay. So then we come to this. And I'm sorry, Oscar, uh, so many examples you are familiar with. Okay, now it's the white term. Black has just played this code hmm. Yeah. Yeah, so Oscar's came also. Yeah. Yeah, I, I have, yeah, normally, yeah, let's say in my, those, the, yeah, those uh, lecture examples, I select from my student's game, my own game, and the pro game. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> uh, until later, you're going to have uh, your time, too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Ah, this is the one about a burglar who got caught and didn't stop stealing. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's the anti description about the game. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh that could be true, but here what white should do. And I first hope you can see where is uh let's say that boss who has played go with you in the bar you first need to find him out and then then rely on him what you can possibly do next mm. so where are the relations mm -hmm. This one is also, I would say, kind of direct. Mm. Uh, the boss seems to be everywhere. <laughs> uh... <laughs> Structure of the company is... Uh, mm, actually, kind of true too, yeah. yeah. Mm. E11 and hope one of the two black groups in the center will die. Uh huh. Okay. Yeah, that is uh, one factor at least. Mm. Use. Is it's the upper the side black group strong? Mm. Ah. This one. How about the upper left corner white group? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, Auntie is basically uh, giving tips on this situation for our viewers. Mm. Yeah. What's going on in the center? Yeah, how to okay. analyze. Is mm. the K3 got a problem? Yeah, so Auntie is basically saying, maybe you feel like, okay, what is strong? I aware Auntie is basically reminding you, there are some uncertainties worldwide as well, actually. Yeah. It's not like purely what is strong everywhere. Mm. 
<laughs> the upper left white group isn't strong. I can start the call with a B19. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Mm. We have seen this game before. Yeah. So some of you might remember what happened. Ah, uh, yeah, we have talked about this in our channel, huh? Uh, yeah, 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 we have. Yeah, yeah, right. Why mm. oh, should we play B19? <laughs> <laughs> sure. <laughs> <laughs> a two-step call, however. Yeah, yeah, because yeah, B nineteen is a two-step call. Why the ignore is still, is still a call. But yeah, that that is a factor also. Yes. Should you quit go if you want to play B nineteen? Well, um, <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, quit is harsh, but uh, uh, well, there's a lot of things you should do the self physical check check checking in go. So for, yeah, when you play B19, uh, I guess, uh, let's say, in Go we say you have some mental health problem. <laughs> Hello, yeah. Elidio, do, do, do. Yeah. Uh, so the topic is uh, about influence and thickness. So yeah, yeah. You, have to, you have to believe in them. You have to be proud that you have them, the relations and stuff, so. <laughs> yeah. yeah, you first, you believe it is valuable Okay, so then let's say in the game, you wouldn't mind, I'm gonna play it. Okay, that is the first thing. And the second, earlier we have introduced with this kind of a real life example about how we are gonna use it. Or let's say, how, yeah, how do we actually manage to actually use this value? But I hope you notice, let's say, uh, in the last example, after black has a strong shape, basically it happened right away. For example, in this shape, when white have the some of the strong shape, for example, on the top right, top right corner, that kind of strong shape, white probably didn't really expect. Okay, it may come to this, it may come to this situation. So there's some of uh, black big stuff. Mm. So yeah. in other words, it's not like, let's say, I have some relationship here and I'm gonna directly use it. You need to wait for the good timing. Mm. Yeah. For example, it's just like earlier I, I have given that example. When you graduate from university and then you are a job seeker and you have your degree and then you went to the job interview, you might get accepted. Imagine you have just entered university and you went there. I guess, uh, yeah, even if you have the re relationship, the boss will gonna tell you, you'd better graduate and then get, get the degree. Then it's easier for us to talk. <laughs> yeah, so it's not timing yet. Hmm. Oh, we have a question um, here. Yeah, yeah. In this game, we have two weak black groups. Should we just start attacking one of them and expect to benefit eventually? Uh, what benefit is eventually plan? is like, yeah, you have to have a plan to like actually benefit. You can't just blindly go uh, go and attack and uh, like uh, just assume that you will benefit somehow. <laughs> yeah. You have to have a plan how you will benefit. And regarding to what is your plan? Uh, it definitely uh, refers to, for example, uh, yeah, pro player we're gonna call it reading, and uh, my language is reading and judgment. So you need to see a few moves ahead and see a situation and tell us, mm, okay, is that in general good or not? Should I do it? Yeah. Okay. Normally, that a few moves ahead, as uh, my experience, it is most likely somewhere between five to eight moves, and then it come to a situation without. Uh, a conclusion, but you can probably already, uh, let's say, uh, even if yeah, there's no direct conclusion, you can already tell yourself, is this good or not? Should I do it or not? Even if uh, it's not absolutely clear, yeah. but it's clearer than, for example, this situation. Oh. Mm. Okay, so far I didn't see a single move yet. Yeah. Am I right? I didn't see a single move yet. I only see B19, but I don't think B19 is a serious suggestion. <laughs> there, was, uh, there was E11 suggestion, but that's quite like uh, abstract. Oh. Just start with that one and then what? Okay, okay. I'm sorry, one sec. Uh, okay. Ah, no worries, no worries. Okay, remember here, I have already mentioned about what, you, let's say here, in this kind of relatively complicated situation, what you should do, think about a few moves ahead, and uh, please uh, try to actually, for both sides, play relatively, uh, okay, I'm not sure, uh, but okay, relatively accurately, let's say on, at least on the right direction, 
for both sides. And then you see a different picture from the from the current picture and tell yourself is that good or not. Yeah, that's basically the way and I want you to think like this and then tell me what you are thinking about. Uh, we could start with M11 and aim to play H13 later to kill the top. That's uh, mm. one plan. Well, if your plan requires also that you are going to kill it, otherwise it's not good, then it's not a good plan usually. If you're not like 100% sure that you can kill it. So like uh, usually your plan should also include like uh, uh, in case your yes. opponent leaves, mm -hmm. uh, then what? What is your benefit mm. then? Yeah. Huh. But yeah, so M M11. Uh... But yeah, so he wants to start with M11 and attack the bottom right, the, or let's say the center group a little bit, and then go back to H13, am I right? H13. And then mm. to actually kill the top. Yeah, mm. so some kind of like a double attack uh, with those yeah. two black groups. Yeah. Mm. Uh, maybe F8 to get stronger uh, to attack H16 by building with L13. So F8 F is... Uh, F8 is... Uh, some okay, I probably full market. Yeah. It so means the, this one is F8. Uh -huh. To get stronger to attack H16. So to attack that black group up black group and then while building L13. Building L13? What do you mean building? Make territory? What do you mean building? I need to understand that wording. That wording is not anything I comprehend. I mean, I comprehend in English, <laughs> but I do not comprehend that in Go. <laughs> uh, B12 B12. looks good. Uh, Has some follow up on the right side while uh, getting stronger. Hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. So now we have at least some some moves. Uh, yeah. I guess we can. Uh, okay. Reveal, really reveal the. Okay. Correct solution. Uh, yeah. Let's say here. Uh, so um, let's say first we need to identify who is weak here. I mean, who specifically are the big groups? Yeah. And earlier we have mentioned. Yeah, on the top left corner, there's B19. But that B19 means locally, in case if white is sealed in or white has nowhere else to run, and outside white cannot get any eye shape, black play B19, it is a two step call. Mm. And when we say we, we need to have an imagined uh, situation, the imagined situation there is uh, white is sealed in, white outside cannot get eyes. But that's not really the case here, right? Mm, mm. So why did that group is probably not so weak. Yeah. And uh, if we look at what bottom earlier, Anti has reminded us about uh, black play the K3 possibility. Mm -hmm. yeah. So if black play K3 there, I don't think you can see a way for black to get a, to maintain the connection at the bottom, right? Mm, yeah. Yeah. In other words, the white bottom group is not alive. But how yeah. weak that group is? Yeah. Yeah, so there you can see what has the Atari Sene at O4. O4 mm -hmm. is white Sene there. So why did that group already have one eye and it has a head to get out? So that group is not that weak, but if black at some point also get to play, for example, the L11 cap mm -hmm. on this spot. I'm not sure if I point to this spot if our viewers can see it or can, can uh -huh. our viewers see it. Obviously not because it's my oh, computer. Yeah. <laughs> it's okay, my okay, computer okay. where the stream is coming from. Okay, but like okay, I, okay. I, I, I'm generally trying to point out. Uh, okay. Yeah. So yeah. My, the, my, my mouse. Here. Yeah. Yeah. If black, we're gonna. Yeah. If black caps here, then let's say what we only need to actually think very seriously about should I actually get a connection? Yeah. At, at the bottom. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So that's actually about white group setters and about the black groups. Uh. I think on the top side of that group clearly it only had one eye, right? Mm. Yeah, on the top. And then in the center there's a tiger shape, but we know that tiger shape is let's say one step away of becoming an eye in general. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So that group is like that. So that group 
uh, before wide play age 13. Yeah, I, I mean, after wide, wide play at age 13, then black will, will probably need to react. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay? And uh, we're referring to the right side group. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, let's say I think uh, Tanuki was talking about the right side group in case if wide played uh, this uh, uh, P12. Yeah. If wide played P12 and the black ignore it, I guess we can imagine black white have, can have the clam, mm -hmm. black react, and we know be here, the black group is not alive. In other words, if white has to fix the, the outside cutting point, the P13 cutting point, black group need to react. Yeah. Okay? And then we talk about the black center group. Uh, black center group, okay, I need to take away those marks. Then white has this peep, isn't it? In which what black need to answer. And then white get out here, and then black will need to answer. So then that group, black kind of only have one eye. Kind of, yeah, let's say that even that one eye is not completely reliable. Which means that if someone has mentioned about uh, if white has uh, a move uh, around here. Yeah. Yeah, I'm 11, right? Yeah, then black that group need to react. Okay, here the thing is, we look at every single case isolatedly. Actually, it is like, you. let's say, when something happens, I need to react. In every single black group there, it is like that. And for white, white only have one such a group. Yeah. Right? Yeah, white only have one such a, such a group, yes, one such a group existing. Yeah. So basically here we say, in general, this is a situation white is attacking, but white still need to be careful. Yeah. Okay, that is number one. And the second, actually now we in general know what how we should start this already. Because we, when we are doing attacking, we need to actually consider Okay, we also have something that we are actually weak by ourselves, and we need to care about it. Yeah. So, so yeah. Then basically, we know that, for example, here, if I were white, yeah, let's say let's make those exchanges first. Mm -hmm. So to make sure that group is just one eye, and then okay, someone has mentioned I'm eleven. I would suggest you just simply jump. Mm -hmm. So to yeah. maintain you yourself is connected. Yeah, stronger shape. Yes. Yeah, and now it is enough for blacks. Yeah, let, that requires blacks to react. Well, you are taking care of your own group, prevent yourself to be in the situation. I have to answer, and there, black will gonna get this cap for free, and then this center circumstances will gonna completely change. Yeah. Okay, so this is normally, the, let's say, I, I guess this is logical as an analysis, so you can see why we should start in this way. And now, when black will need to react on a group, okay, then it come to this attack. Yeah. Okay, like this, white wouldn't worry about, okay, so here I may actually lose, lose, lose control at some point, and then when I'm attacking him, suddenly, crap, I'm under attack. Mm. Yeah, so, yeah, first you need to have the whole board analysis. Yeah, and then identify the, let's say, different V group and its status, and then, Let's say, find the moves in this kind of complicated situation. What are the moves? What is the what, what is the move that affect as many groups as possible? Not just one, normally. Yeah. Not just the one. Yeah, if you are just doing one, you may be counterattacked. There, there are exceptions. For example, I'm just affecting one. But, well, if I, just, if I can kill this one, mm. My, my, let's say, even if you say, I have big groups, it can die, I don't care, because yours is much bigger. Mm. Then go ahead, then go ahead, because that one is unique. And so basically, in that case, uh, in our mind, the definition is supposed to be, there's not just that one big group. The rest of the big group, compared to him, they are not a big group, because it doesn't matter. Mm. Yeah, so in your mind, you must tell yourself like that. Okay, so if white play like this, white will gonna dominate the board. Okay, but here, yeah, there's one thing we didn't mention as for our this uh, lecture. Where is the boss? Who is the boss? You know. Hmm. Actually, uh, yeah, let's say people had mentioned that people just uh, didn't really point out who is the boss. Yeah. Obviously, there are two bosses available here. Mm -hmm. One is what is extremely strong actually around here, right? Yeah, that Kako said uh, now, uh, M16 yeah. area, yes. yes yeah, yes, that yes. area, that one just naturally exists. Yeah. Second one, people didn't mention, but actually you already know that it exists. How it is possible we directly peep here when black can push? Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, why? Because uh, yeah, it's it's very natural. Black has three stones here that is in shortage of liberty. Yeah. Yeah. So here we can rely on that, and we can directly peep there. So yeah. here, those that's the black stone there. It looks like it is enemy. That's our boss, and that is something that can actually help us to get the jump. Mm. He will gonna help us even though it belongs to the other color. Yeah. Yeah, because he is in short of liberty. He has some difficulty. He has to agree with the, our terms. Mm. Yeah. yeah, we have the boss to rely on, and if uh, here we say we just uh, play normal, for example, I dare not peep at B, then Asian languages, you're stupid. You have the real, yeah, real relationship, you are not using it, that's stupid. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah, it is something like that. <laughs> yeah, we have yeah, private photo, not... photos of E12. <laughs> yeah. You, yeah you, you may say, you dare not agree with this my term. You know, yeah. there will be consequences. Yeah. yeah. You know that. All right. So do as what I say. And uh, okay, I guess uh, for many of us, uh, I guess, uh, for example, if I say, hey, we are making a movie and uh, you need to be actor and uh, you say those words, maybe you, you can say that. Okay. If it is real, I'm not sure if you can say that. <laughs> and definitely, I'm, I, I believe you're not going to be proud of it. On the go board, be proud of it. Mm. Because you have the relationship others doesn't have. Mm. You have to be proud of it. You, let's say here, it is important that you actually can work across that moral line there. There's no such thing as morality in golf. Hmm. So, and so, uh, Go is like acting uh, the real life. So like you, you have to be proud when you're a flexible actor. Like uh, in that kind of movie, you have to be proud that I am going to act this uh, the best I can. Uh, yeah, so yeah. it's a si similar situation. So like, uh, what happens in movie is not real, but it's like kind of like uh, reenacting re re actment of like yeah. uh, real life. So Go is yeah. similar. <laughs> yeah, just like our uh, our uh, our lecture yesterday. Yeah, I, let's say about Moyo. It, 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 that is actually uh, something similar. If on the Go board you say. I'm the most successful dictator oh. in Go. Yeah. Be proud of it. You're yeah. awesome. <laughs> yeah. yeah, you're definitely yeah. awesome. If you, you, you say I'm not the most successful dictator in Go. Yeah. Yeah, because yeah, let's say I don't think many people can say, okay, when I'm playing the uh, yeah, Go in dictatorship, I'm I'm an expert. Not many. So you should be proud of it. I think auntie's the auntie is a pretty expert in dictatorship. <laughs> yeah, seriously, auntie is you've got your auntie yeah make me suffer so many times. <laughs> yeah. 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 You, you should say I have. I think I have done an awesome job. Huh. Yes. Okay. So yeah, this is actually the second example. I would still say this is uh, let's say one of the relatively easy one. I'm not sure. This is probably already hard to you, Miko. Well, it is certainly a more complicated situation, indeed. More complicated one, yeah. Right? yeah. yeah. Because there's yeah. something about That's a big okay. group that you do need to do analysis and then find out what is uh, reasonable. Yeah. But in general, yeah. like uh, it's quite clear that like uh, you have to combine those uh, three weaknesses uh, somehow. So like uh, I don't know if I would be able to like uh, play perfectly here, but like at least I has, I should have like, some kind of idea that, like uh, yeah. what to like uh, at least try to do. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but it doesn't matter because uh, yeah, let's say uh, yeah, Oscar is silent here. Uh, yeah, actually, yeah, Oscar is the, probably the only one who remembers and. Uh, Basically, the variation I'm showing here is not what actually happened in the game. Yeah, what happened in the game, people didn't really play perfectly. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, yeah. Beyond to me, this is this is uh, this is the correct way. And uh, yeah, in the game, actually, what I did is not the best. Yeah. Mm. But okay, yeah. Now let's come to the next example. Mm. Uh, yeah. Okay. Uh, I'm I'm pretty sure Auntie is still here. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. All right. So this border situation, you can see why it actually has a lot of territory, right? Mm. Yeah. Yeah, Auntie doesn't. Yeah, uh, Auntie doesn't remember what. Uh, yeah, which game is this? <laughs> um, I'm pretty sure. Well, Auntie said just that, like looks familiar. Yeah, I know, I know. Yeah, but uh, I'm I I believe he doesn't remember which game is this. So basically, white has a lot of territory. Black territory, black has some territory, limited. But yeah. uh, let's say, how can black win this? Uh. 
No, yeah, you, you can feel anti doesn't remember this. Ah, and sometimes yeah. it's super scary that you remember our games better than uh, we do. <laughs> ah. <laughs> no. Like, yeah, it was uh, 12 years ago, that one tournament and third round. And... <laughs> okay, yeah, but it is good that Anti doesn't remember because here I actually want Anti to figure out where he has played his arm move next. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so he doesn't remember, and here he basically needs to play this, yeah, this game again. Where you played your move in the game? So I assume uh, Anti was black. Yeah. Is this a game between we two? No. Okay, so basically this board is a slightly different one. I probably should tell about this first. Uh, yeah, okay, Auntie can take his minute. Well, I'm gonna tell uh, our viewers something here. Mm -hmm. This board is very different for on this board, they will say, is there any V group black actually use his influence? I'm sorry, none. Oh. There's no big group, right? Yeah. So Black need to actually find out his potential or his points somewhere. Otherwise, you can see White has actually so much territory there. Uh, Black will not gonna have enough if things just goes normal. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But here, please remember, Black has so many boss surrounding to rely on. You can actually do something extraordinary. Normally, you, would, you wouldn't dream to do, but here you can. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And six and J seven. Ah, uh, what Andy is talking about? I'm sorry. Uh, so black has uh, stones. Uh, on, on uh, I, 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 no, I, I guess I understand what he's talking about. Okay. Uh, he is actually uh, talking to us about where is the black border in the center. Mm -mm. So black kind of have, ha has already stones around here. Yeah, inserting is an opening. He is basically saying inserting. There's a hole. Okay, yeah. I need to translate on his wording. Yeah. Yeah. But our upper side group is safe. <laughs> yeah. Why well, I need to translate every single word? <laughs> yeah. Fine. It should be safe. Ah. Uh, yeah. I guess there was uh, like a few suggestions already, like K6 or... Oh, K6, or, I'm, seeing, uh, I'm paying attention only on anti. Or okay, I think G11. G11, mm. Probably G12. Uh. Yeah, G12 came already like a uh, few times now. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, Auntie, we're gonna play D12. Now. Yeah, well, Dave said that first. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Dave said that first. Okay, very good. Okay. Yeah. Dave has a good, uh, like, uh, uh, percentage in guessing. <laughs> okay. Ah, Is like it... Auntie said, like, he's not sure. Nowadays, I tend to swap it around. What is the best white can do if black doesn't do anything? Yeah, okay. Yeah, then that's an important tip, yeah. Okay, but yeah, I guess here we should already talk about it. Uh, uh, Auntie, I first show, uh, if you don't mind, I will first show what Auntie has done in that game. Mm -hmm. yeah. uh, can I do that? Yeah, okay. What Auntie has done in that game was uh, this attachment. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, and the falling, uh, let's say here in the game, white also. On the push here. And uh, then next to black did the honey. Mm -hmm. And then black here, double honey. Mm -hmm. I, I, I'm, I'm just showing what happened in the game. Okay. And then black push. Oh, yeah, we don't have the names here. Like, that's true. Uh, uh, what? Uh, I forgot to like put that like yeah I'm Mikko and you're Chef so oh, 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 we don't oh, have okay, those okay, okay. yeah but yeah okay yeah like well 
Hello, I'm Mikko, I'm Forden, yeah, I'm and Jeff. Uh, yeah. Jeff uh, like on paper, uh, six ton, but like, uh, yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> let's let's leave it that. Uh, yeah, yeah, we we are not going to mess up the UI at the moment, yeah. uh, or like the the the, the, the layouts, but uh, yeah, good good. Uh, yeah. Good uh, feedback. We will we, yeah. do that. Yeah, and you know, uh, yeah, let's say yes, yeah, so something. Yes, yes, yeah. Let's say in the past, uh, yeah, this happens as well. Yeah, sometimes I didn't talk to Auntie, but we somehow have agreement. When I look at the, this example, yeah, the result I like it, but somehow I'm saying, how is it possible black ask white to answer and white just did all the way here? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So here, yeah, let's say white, yeah, white, white wouldn't just answer all the way. Especially, let's say those stones compared to the center, what is important, it is clear. So here, I actually somehow reached a similar conclusion. Let me back to do this first. Yeah. Yeah, this is actually the way he actually reached, let's say, the intention Black has reached uh, in the game of his wider cooperation. Mm. And Dave was yeah. again right. <laughs> yeah, 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 again right. Yeah, that's pretty awesome. <laughs> yeah. but, but let's say here, if, like, if something like this happens, so basically, we can actually imagine something similar to the game. We, yeah, we, we are going to have it on the black. Suddenly, we're going to have influence. So probably here, let's say, to be accurate, black like, is colorful. Let's do this. Mm -hmm. OK, so here, like this, so then suddenly we can see in the center, there's something actually pretty big happens. And uh, although there's one hole there at inserting, it wouldn't really affect this center territory too much. Yeah. Yeah, so this is the case. But okay, I want to you to I want you to imagine if without any circumstances to support, will anyone think about in this kind of shape? I'm gonna attach this one. Mm. Yeah, this is actually the yeah, this is actually something more important. Let's say here, we only if we have the surrounding to support us, then we can actually think about this. Otherwise we wouldn't even think about it. Yeah. Yeah. But okay, it is important when you have the boss to support you, you can actually push your yeah, push your limit and then let's say dig your potential out and this is the way. Yeah. Uh how we will go after what G eleven, I'm sorry. Uh F eleven, I guess. But that we already showed. Yeah. And honey, I guess. Yeah. 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 This one just. Uh, and honey, because white didn't really ah, white. leave. Yeah. 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 What? 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 What is uh, still in the situation that what is in shortage of liberty? Yeah. Uh sorry. G eleven. This one. Well, what is still not out of that kind of situation? So here, I think black double honey. Mm. Yeah. In general, we handle the center. Yeah, why the yeah those stones are still in shelter of liberty. True. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I'm not, I'm not sure if I explained everything clearly. Yeah, it is true that here you can also do the specific like this, and we directly get the points. Yeah. Mm, yeah. Why is it called a double honey crap? I, I'm not. Uh, well, why is it called top? it's true that this one should be called honey, huh? It's kind of like uh, white honey in this kind of situation. You counter honey, so is it counter honey <laughs> or? Mm, yeah, it's probably counter honey is right. Double honey is doesn't look right in this case. Yeah, this one shouldn't be called as double honey. I didn't think about it. Yeah, it, the situation has two honeys, but they are like uh, on both sides, like black and white. Yeah, 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 yeah. True. Yeah, this one. I don't know. Probably Japan, Japanese probably have their own terms for every kind of these kind of things, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so I don't know. Antic, Antic can probably help us. Uh, yeah. What is this called? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, Antic said like um, Anti and feel, uh, Jeff feel like it's a double honey because it's a honey from a lone stone that only has two liberties yeah 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 yeah. I, yeah, that, yeah. that is exactly my feeling but uh, yeah. strictly i think they are right this one shouldn't be called as double honey <laughs> strictly i think they are right yeah, uh. yeah so yeah yeah it's not correct term but like uh, yeah, yeah yeah i i wonder if um, uh auntie has like some japanese term for this one also <laughs> okay okay oh interesting 
Uh, okay, so at the end, uh, Auntie just want to tell you, this is back to long, long ago. This is your game with Jack. <laughs> yeah, so okay, like, it's very possible that it's like something like 12 years ago. <laughs> yeah. like, I just threw that one. But yeah. And this, this, is, uh, this is a game you won, actually. And uh, I'm not sure, probably this is the first game you won against a pro in an in a even game. Mm. Oh, so that is 2009, right? Yeah, somewhere around there. And so, yeah, I, that, is, that is why here I easily have this game record. Yeah. No coming? No coming, probably. Yeah, that could be. Oh, probably at that time, no coming, true. Okay. Yeah, yeah, could be. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But okay, anyways, let's not come to the next video because actually, let's say I have prepared six examples and we have only done three. Let's go forward. Yeah. Mm, the next one, finally, it comes to something I like because... Uh... Mm. Okay, I'm not sure if Oscar... Yeah, Auntie is definitely here. I'm not sure if Oscar is here. This is from my game. Can you imagine I'm this white? <laughs> mm, yeah. I'm this white. Okay, I, I probably should show yeah, this. Yeah, yeah, you look more like black. <laughs> I look more like black, yeah. But uh, in this game, I'm the one who play like this. Mm. And I play all the way like this. <laughs> and I give all the territory there, and I make more. Right. Yeah. Okay, and so, uh, yeah, okay, I will show. Yeah, this is a pretty polarized game. <laughs> yeah. But okay, so here let's still yeah let's come to this theory. No black push. Mm. Yeah. Uh, Oscar, you know, uh, let's say uh, uh, this is a game uh, I recently look into my Titan record and I find this this game is so fun, and I noticed, huh, I play this fight. How is that possible? <laughs> Yeah, and uh, yeah, so th this is my time, time record, and this is one of the games I have played back to several years ago. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but okay, so here, we, we know where the boss exists. We don't need to ask that question. And here, the question is the black push, and then we have the boss to rely on, mm -hmm. and what shall we do? And uh, earlier, let's say, we, we say, when you are a job seeker, you can actually probably use your relations to get the job. We say, if you have done something wrong in the company, assuming your boss, yeah, let's say it's the son of the boss, you are not going to be fired. Mm -hmm. And uh, gradually, you know, here we are talking about bigger and bigger corruption. <laughs> <laughs> we are talking about bigger. Uh -huh. uh, this one is uh, gradually like... I have done some crime. So what? I'm the I'm the son of president. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. We are the boss, so it's time to grill. Yeah. Okay. So normally, like I said, when this push happens, we know normally what we should do. But here, I'm not talking about what you should do normally. Mm -hmm. You know, yeah, when I saw when, when when I see this game at this point, I'm very surprised about what I have done during the game. It's crazy. Yeah, let's say you you ask me to do it now, I will gonna have a difficulty. I mean, I might do it, but I will, I will have a difficulty. I might have an idea what uh, we're going to do, but yeah, let's leave it that to chat. Yeah, let us leave, leave, leave that to chat. Yeah. This kind of mode lets you get away with some pretty great uh, change stuff. Uh, great stuff. Mm -hmm. I suppose that what you mean by corruption. Yeah. 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 Let's say something you wouldn't even dream about. You wanna do normally, and here with uh, with the surrounding support, you're gonna see, you're gonna consider to do it. H twelve mm -hmm. doesn't look possible. H fifteen looks possible. Hmm. It's a bit hard to read. Yeah, I only got the idea. Only got the idea. Yeah, is that really good? Yes. I yeah, when I look at it, I hesitated too. <laughs> yeah, the auntie has done that he himself. <laughs> but is that really good? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, after you have read it and you know that it works, is it good? That is the next question always. 
<laughs> don't do it, man. <laughs> mm. Yeah, let's say in the past, when you do that against me, that's what I have told you. Yeah. <laughs> mm. Oh my God. Hmm. The present me okay. just grill. What you are talking is revolution. Ah. And Oscar said like uh, H two, H fifteen, G fifteen, and then H twelve cut. Yeah, I saw that. Yeah. yeah. So uh, yeah, that, yeah, that, that's why only I react, react like that. Okay. So here, I guess it's just I react already. Yeah. So in the game, I play the honey. Mm -hmm. Yeah. In the game, I play honey, and to me here, black has no choice but to go back to connect, and so allow mm -hmm. me to get the nobby, and I get the entire top side territory. Yeah. To me, that's legal. Okay. And in the game, black play honey. Yeah. Uh, no, no, we have no choice, right? Yeah, I, uh -huh. I think exactly the same as as Oscar. No, we have no choice. Cut. Yeah, yeah. And uh, that means that on the top side, it's come to a panoki. Uh, so I, I, I thought it's something much more crazy. <laughs> no, 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 no. Yeah, it's uh, it's it, yeah, it's just like this. Yeah. Yeah. So it's like this, and then there's a panoki. But who said the panoki is alive? Under these circumstances, mm, mm. right? Yeah, so yeah. Panuki is, is not alive. So in the game, you, you can see Black Center is extremely weak now. And so Black needs to, let's say, in the game, he put here, on Black Tiger here. Mm. And uh, yeah, so the younger version of Jeff first play this peep. So make sure his center cannot easily live. Mm -hmm. And then attack this. Yeah. So who that Panuki is, is alive? It's not. Mm. Yeah, so here we have the surround to support. We give it the panoki and we're gonna kill it. And let's say <laughs> I yeah earlier Auntie was, was yeah was talking and so I thought let's say Auntie knows what I'm talking about because yeah I, I'm pretty sure Miko you remember when I play I I, I get I, I played against Auntie. Auntie has done this several times. He actually gave me a panoki mm -hmm. domain or moyo and then he tried to kill me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He has done that so many times and. Uh, uh, that actually comes from, uh, I think at that time, Auntie was actually reading some Fujitawa Shuko's game, and uh, Fujitawa Shuko has done that. So give the opponent Panoki and then kill it. Yeah. Yeah, okay, but they are talking about something more crazy, huh? H12. What? Okay, let me see what Auntie is talking about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I actually thought also like H12 directly. Directly? Yeah. It's J15 and then what? Then J11, K12. J11, K12, I'm on that, and H15. What is it? It's it like this. Oh. <laughs> Definitely something more crazy. Mm, to me, less, because black wouldn't die. What is the more like uh, trying to attack black as a whole and get the rest uh, territory? Mm. Because next move black can only do this, and uh, his idea is do this, and uh, next I don't know, something like this? I don't know, yeah, let's say here, yeah, yeah, but, yeah, this, black, this is harder to control. Yeah, black, yeah, black doesn't... Probably. Because black wouldn't <laughs> die here, and yeah. what is just uh, to, to trying to get uh, the, all the territory, I actually prefer this idea. This idea will kill. Yeah, will yeah, kill. yeah. yeah but like they probably thought that it's something like this because you were like selling the problem like that. That it's like a, ah, a, like even more corruption and love. This is so drastic. Oh, no, and no. Da, 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 da. Okay, okay, I got it. But yeah. to me here, I have honey here and your honey, and the next I give you the panuki and I'm gonna kill your panuki. To me, this is already corrupted enough. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, you give the opponent a panuki there, and you say, I'm gonna kill him next. To me, yeah, yeah that, that's corrupted enough. But why we can do that? Because of the, yeah, the surrounding that is supporting us. Hmm. 
Uh, so Oscar, yeah, let's say o Oscar has yeah, mentioned this, and Oscar has this kind of idea. I mean, so basically back to 10 years ago, probably I was Oscar. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we, yeah, I, I was playing this kind of goal myself. And Oscar, you know, yeah, I've told you, this is from my Titan record. So uh, this is a game I played by, back to nearly 10 years ago. Wow. And uh, the, yeah, this is, uh, yeah, I, the, this is at that time Titan of Nida. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, Black will sacrifice this center. Yeah, so you are saying here like this, and Black will gonna let the entire center go. Yeah, okay, and then, then just leave that. Maybe, that, yeah, that, yeah, that, gonna that make is a plan. Me, yeah. yeah, that will gonna make me uncomfortable, but I can't see my Hoshi on the top left corner die. I still think White will probably like this have enough. Hmm. Yeah, that, yeah, but uh, yeah, that plan will gonna make me uncomfortable. Because, yeah, sure. Black yeah, corner okay. is huge. And then Black has also some other pits, so yeah. is the center going to be enough? <laughs> mm. <laughs> All right. Yeah, so uh, here, okay, I, I still want to come back to our topic. So normally, yeah, let's say Antis right, Antis said, I can only see here we have two options, and uh, it doesn't look like uh, here, let's say, uh, for example, here, because we need to save our two stones there. Oh, the first shape there's only A and B. I'm sorry, oh yeah, okay, A and B here. And normally people will gonna play A, why? You play B, they open honey, you need to answer, and then he, then he come back. So you play B is not a benefit, you have to open to get a move outside there. Yeah. But here, this is a special situation, you need to think about in a special way here, which means you're gonna think about, I give a panel key, it is considerable. Why? I have a people surrounding to support me. Why cannot? Oh, A is yeah, that is mm. So Auntie would have played A. Auntie probably would have played A here. Mm. Yeah, uh, Auntie is basically saying your this group is not alive. I'm gonna just uh, attack you smoothly, slowly, and get the other side as territory. You, eventually, you leave, and I get the territory, and let's play you side, and I win by a bit. Probably. <laughs> that's more. That's more like him. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I, I, I know that. Yeah, the, the, that's more like him. I, however, prefer this uh, drastic way. Uh, so, how did this game end? Chat is asking. Well, how did this game end? Um, did you I kill the Panoki? <laughs> I killed the Panoki, mm. and uh, Black Center is alive. And try to get the kill the Panoki group, and also get the B8 and the top, top level corner. Everything. Mm, okay, so you win. I suppose. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, that, yeah. That is a story, and there's actually there's some more funny story, but that's not the part of uh, this game. Also, uh, yeah, something we should talk about in this lecture. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. Okay. So okay, yeah. So so far, I'm getting examples from, uh, let's say, uh, let's say, uh, uh, in general, amateur players game. There was one anti game, but at that time, anti was. Uh, some distance away from a professional player's level. Yeah. Yeah. And the following, I'm gonna give some professional example. Yeah. And uh, when we talk about for professional example, as I have mentioned earlier, there corruption may happen, but other side wouldn't give you a good chance to actually get a huge income from the corruption. Mm. So let's say this kind of a drastic situation wouldn't easily happen in yeah in, in top pro competition. Yeah. And uh, I first want to show this, and this is a game I'm pretty sure some of you are pretty familiar with. Uh, I'm sorry, give me a moment. Uh, so, yeah. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Anyone is familiar with this game? I'm pretty sure Auntie knows this game. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. Those two stars in the center look uh, funny. Uh, yeah, man, yeah, many, uh, yeah, many people probably also know about this. Yeah, those two stones in the center, I probably should show how it comes here. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. So uh, it was, uh, so this kind of situation, uh -huh. and what say? Okay, I have the bosses uh, there, and so I'm gonna get some sort of moil in the center. Uh -huh. And the black first I'll put here, so to actually make that the C six stone strong as a base, so to further reduce. Uh -huh. And what? Yeah. I exchange here and then 
play the two-space jump. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, Toe was white. Mm. Yeah, Yamato, correct. Yes, and this is, uh, I think, the uh, 2018 made in, made in final game seven, so the very last game. So black is uh, Yamayuta, and... Oh, no, white. Uh, yeah, black is Yamayuta, and white is Toe. Yeah. Uh, this one is a pretty famous one, and uh, let's say in many media they have actually they have been talking about it. Mm. Yeah, so I believe I, I yeah let's say that is why I believe you remember this. Mm. All right, but doesn't matter. So here, yeah, this is the situation. Yeah. Well, uh, when we look at this border situation, it looks difficult for white, right? Mm -hmm. Because white has some very low territory at the bottom. Yeah. Black has so many. Yeah. And uh, White will need to actually rely on his, this box on the top left area in order to win the game. Yeah. The problem is, how? Because I can't see White kill this stone. Black Ship mm. is pretty strong. And White has a cutting point there at the, at the D13. That's the point when White plays this one. Mm. Mm. Yeah, so uh, here, the, the problem is how white can possibly win this game. And uh, about the, okay, about this example the, and the next example, things they are from the top pro game. I basically want to actually just show the example, and uh, let's say here, yeah, here, earlier I have already showed some examples from the, uh, let's say, amateur games, and uh, there you can see some, my introduction about the ways. They are most likely the ways you're going to use in your own game. If it, for example, come to this kind of situation, I would say it is probably difficult for many of you, but here I will just use the, the pro game to actually further introduce about ways. But this kind of example will also, I hope, enhance your belief. So in your game, you get influence, you get those kind of strong shape, it will eventually repay you. You wouldn't worry too much about it. In the end, you wouldn't have enough territory. Once, you're going to abuse of your power a little bit. You have a little bit of problem. You can't just say, let's say I just do the normal business. Then you definitely wouldn't have enough. You need to rely on it a little bit. Mm. Okay. So here, let's say, I would, I mainly here, I, this example and the next example, I just want to show. You can see how White handled the following game, and then how did they, one step by another, had to victory. Mm. Okay. So here, Black has that, 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 that uh, that, uh, that stone that is weak, and the white has a cutting point. Can you imagine where one start next? I guess you have a difficulty to do imagine in, in the game, even for those who have seen the game. Yeah. Yeah, because uh, in the game next, uh, what plays the this? Ah, oh, somebody said uh, C18. Yeah, this That's is close. Almost, yeah, close. Almost, yes. Yeah, so here, first, the white threat the corner. Mm -hmm. White is right the corner, and White is actually taking small benefit. So White is saying, here, your corner is under threatening, and then I have some center moves here around A, so I can kill your corner. And then, if I can get two moves in a, in a row around your stone, you are in trouble, right? Mm. Yeah. Okay, he's threatening. Well, he's taking small benefit, because this this, this, this is an, and he can potentially take the corner. That's some user benefit, right? Yeah. Yeah? All right. So, and the black will need to react. And the white just jump. So first, the white make sure black wouldn't get the side territory. Uh -huh. And the black run. Okay, it's very, very easy. And then black white go back to defend his uh, yeah his own cutting point. Well, he's also making making it slightly bigger on top top side. Yeah. Okay. And uh, yeah, here yeah yeah black nobby here. So to pre yeah prevent the corner to be harassed, well aiming at the push and cut. Uh -huh. And the white play this funny one. <laughs> Hmm. Yeah, yeah. What play the yeah this funny one? He's actually aiming at to cut black off with, uh, let's say, move like this, this and cut. Uh, uh yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. Here, let's say, yeah. Assuming if well, yeah, if oh, okay, my order here is not. If black answer at one, and mm -hmm. then that A B C can happen. Mm -hmm. Okay, once again here, this is what the plan. But can anyone dream about A B C without any boss to support you? <laughs> and here. You have the boss to rely on, you can do it. Yeah, right. Yeah, and the black need to be super cautious, and the black cannot just say, oh, you play the elephant eye there, and I just break you. Mm -hmm. You need to be cautious, because this guy, he has some boss stand, standing behind him, he has the support. Yeah, so here, 
yes, black needs to be super cautious, black honey. Mm -hmm. And now white automatically get to fix uh, his own cutting point earlier at uh, eight. Mm, mm, yeah. Yeah. And then white, oh yeah, white just uh, play honey here, so to keep black separated. Yeah. Yeah. So to keep black separated, so he let's say keep black weak, and so he can still attack. Yeah. And first now here, he let's say earlier he has already taken some uh, use of benefit. He for the first to take use of benefit, so to actually make the gap on territory closer. Mm, yeah. So you can see here in professional game, you can actually do the corruption, but your opponent is actually pretty cautious. He wouldn't actually put you, uh, give you any kind of uh, chance. Say, you can kill me something, right? By relying on the boss support, you wouldn't have that kind of opportunity. So in the, in this kind of game, when the opponent is very cautious, you need to be patient and take the benefit little by little. And uh, here, let's say if you can actually all the way, all the way. Yeah, keep in mind, I have them to support me. I can do over the line. Well, you are patient, getting it little by little by relying on those boss. You have enough points in the end. We'll see about that. Hmm. Okay, so black push and the black play the Kosumi. So black is actually black already. With this gender, he's actually yeah, losing something, but he is trying to limit that. Yeah, this way he's saying, I can connect or, yeah. or I can. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. And uh, here you can see white is once again very patient. Mm -hmm. So white hunter here to attack while getting a few points at the bottom. Mm, yeah. Yeah. Many people will gonna say this kind of move. I don't want to play that. <laughs> I'm attacking here here black, but I need to get a lot of out from attacking black. I just capture that F3 stone. That's yeah. not enough. But you need to be patient. Mm. This is just your first part payment. There's four payment upcoming. This is just like uh, how you call it. You, you know when we go to store, we buy those kind of stuff. Mm -hmm. And they say, hey, you just need to, pay, yeah, let's say, give your first pay. And then the following, you can pay in the following 12 months. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. let's say, this is just your first payment. You're going to gradually receive the payment. It's not like this phone is just 50 euro. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I know many people is impatient. You want your money now. Yeah. That way, you're going to have a difficulty to handle influence and sickness. You need to be patient. Yeah, this is actually a game, a game that tests your patience. Yeah. 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 <clears throat> okay. Yeah, so here, why to get a little bit more. And here, yeah, let's, yeah on the top side, why uh, once again get a little bit more on the top. Now, top side look like there's some territory, right? Yeah. 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 And the black is, uh, yeah, let's say here, another secret in Moyo game is you may say black has a lot of territory, but you know what? Black can hardly increase in the in the rest of the game. Why? Because his work is basically, oh, okay, here I have something I have to worry about. I need oh. to actually take it. Here I have something weak, I, I need to take care of it. So oh. Oh. in the rest of the game, you are the only one that will gonna increase. The opponent will not gonna increase in general. So oh. you're gonna see earlier there is probably a big gap on territory, but in the remaining game, this line is basically going slightly, yeah, go going down like that in general. The question is only basically the one who takes territory first is praying when this game will gonna end, god damn it, please end soon. Because I'm about to lose my lead. Mm. Yeah, so he's praying for the game to end soon and uh, so basically he can still hold a little bit lead. Yeah, let's say before this this line goes down go goes be beyond the line there, beyond the balance. That's yeah. that that's basically that's basically the the story here. So the one who plays the in ter ter territorial way, actually in this kind of game, as my experience, is actually in a harder position. It's actually in a harder position because you need to, for example, you have many things you need to worry about. Well, you need to care about the balance on territory. And for the other side, he just uh, yeah, he just need to keep pushing because I need I need to care I need to catch up, and that's the only thing I can I concern about. I don't need to keep care about anything else. Yeah. Yeah. So it is relatively easier for the one that actually. Uh, who take influence? Yeah, let's say uh, at at the start. Although you are behind on territory. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. And here, white is basically attacking and giving black whole group pressure. Mm -hmm. And black need to react again. Yeah. Yeah. And here he's attacking the shape. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And now you can see this is basically he so he knows if he cut in the center directly, it wouldn't work because his his shape in the center is too fragile. He's yeah. trying to benefit on the right. 
Yeah, and in the game, black attack here first, and uh, black actually successfully captured those two stones, and then black group is in general safe. But note, initially at the bottom, white doesn't have the entire territory. Now white also has the income from the K3 area. Mm, yeah. Yeah. Okay, and now black says, now I can answer. Uh -huh. So he can answer, but the, the payment here is, uh, let's say, white gets those artillery and this artillery here. And uh -huh. now white center becomes strong, together with all earlier, those center, those few stones. Can you see, let's say, potentially white can get a few points from there as well? Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, in the center area. You initially, it's weak, and now white can actually get a few points from there. Yeah. Okay, so here, yeah, white is basically, yeah, white is first pushing black while he's making a few points in the center for himself. Yeah. Yeah, and the black will need to react all the way because black, yeah, let's say this move, he's fixing the honey. Yeah, this move is aiming at that P5 honey, so black need to fix it. And this one, he's fixing the cutting point. Mm. Yeah. And now it's here, he basically get the, yeah, let's say, get the small benefit again. Mm -hmm. And then finally he got this. Now, if you look at this board, I guess here you you may still say what is behind on territory, but compared to earlier, he's what not much behind. Hmm. I guess what is no longer much behind already, right? By just basically squeezing all those. And please don't forget, around the A area, what has a potential? Around the B area, what has a potential? Huh. Where's black potential? Yeah, I can't see it. So mm. white can still further increase. Yeah. Okay, I'm not saying here this game white played that good and black is playing that bad. Black is actually also playing pretty well and let's say trying his best to take care of his group and limit white. And yeah. for now, I play, yeah, let's say at this moment I can hardly say white is leading. Mm. But here I'm just saying, as you can see, here white is basically doing the squeezing work little by little. Mm. And White is catching up just naturally without a black mistake. Why? That's normal. Because you have surrounding balls to rely on. Once you squeeze it, you're going to get something more than normal. And a black need to actually try his very best to limit you everywhere. He cannot increase. So you're going to naturally catch up on territory. Hmm. So don't worry about... Yeah, I still want to come back here. Don't worry about when it comes to this shit. Crap! Why I choose to play? influence at the first place, I can't have enough. Mm -hmm. Once you squeeze, you will have enough. It is important you rely on them and uh, you do the corruption. Mm. You, yeah, but if you say, I cannot do that, then, then here, there's nothing you can do. But if here, you are confident, I'm gonna squeeze. Yeah, I will squeeze, I'm capable to do that. I'm, uh, yeah, then I, I would recommend you, you have the belief on influence and sickness. Yeah, once you have the belief, this is a game you can handle. Actually, you can see it is actually harder for black to handle in this kind of game because he needs to care about his big group. At the same time, he needs to care about the balance on territory. Yeah, I have played several games with anti like this in the past that I actually noticed. Uh, I take care of my big group. My big group is alive. That's not enough. And mm -hmm. anti didn't even care about my group is alive. Mm. Yeah, he just uh, pushed me. And eventually I leave, I can't, I don't have enough. So gradually in my game with anti, it comes to, let's say, I gamble more. Basically, my group is still not alive, but I don't care about that, and I, you know, let, let, let's say, I just fight for points, and then I force anti to try to kill me. Yeah. Yeah, how, yeah, how, how come that is? So you can see here, that's basically the logic. The one who has more you, who just need to attack and squeeze and get, get more stuff. The one who is actually getting territory at first, you need to care about the group. Well, you need to care about the balance of territory. Mm. Yeah. So here, yeah, that is the story here. And so here in this game, what is actually doing exactly the same? Yeah. I'm just saying, if you try it out, you are gonna, you are gonna notice. You are gonna notice this kind of game is actually easier for the one who take influence to handle. Mm. Yeah. Okay, yeah, so yeah, this is actually the, the, this example. And finally, I'd like to show this one last example. And this one, I don't think many people is familiar with because this is a game just has played recently. Mm. Okay, let me see. Uh, there was a question. Why doesn't Black just answer to D18? Well, then, what against? Mm. Right? 
那么呀，那也 if I if I play here and yeah, 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 if you just answer this exchange one again because there it is supposed to be who get that uh, yeah who get who get around that honey is fifty fifty chance like this but then white just purely again. Mm. Yes, because here in in this kind of game, what the white want to do is basically to actually get a benefit little by little in order to actually catch up here. And so here, if you already I uh, admit okay, you get that little then white is very strong. Ah, oh, Ante would also uh, answer. Okay. Uh, to me, what Black did in the game is right because uh, let's say here it's not necessarily what can get that incident. Yeah, I guess normally yeah, they, they, this kind of decent for for yeah, Black to push here and uh, to get the uh, away from the corner is natural. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. So, so yeah, to, yeah, I, I, I would say what Black did here is, is not, I mean, rarely anyone in this kind of corner will say, you, yeah, you, you take this, okay, that's also. I would say it's so, it, it's so rare. Yeah. Normally, if we have an enemy to fight, we will fight. Yeah. Bitwell is probably okay, uh, what Japanese call Kiai. I, I don't know that term, yeah. Translated in English, uh, do your worst. Ah, that sounds bad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that sounds bad. I don't like this direct translation. Fighting spirit. Ah, that's probably better. Thank you. Yeah, <laughs> do your worst that sounds terrible. <laughs> <laughs> At least that sounds better. I mean, do your worst is, is definitely sounds bad. Yeah. Air meeting. Yeah. In Korean, it's kihap. Okay. Uh, uh, I okay. If you don't mind, I'm gonna continue because I I, I noticed we are already yeah. at one uh, one half hour. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. This is a recent pro game, and this is the yeah yeah you know I watch a, a lot of uh, yeah pro games, and this is one of the recent pro game I like a lot. Oh. I'm wondering who will gonna believe what wins this game in the end. Like this. Well, black has a lot of territory and. <laughs> and where's white territory? Yeah, well, yeah, where's white territory? So, at at a glance, it looks very good for black. Yeah. But the problem here is, I want. I first want to tell. Mm. I I first want to tell. Uh, in this game, in the falling, white actually didn't do anything very special. And white just wins. Mm. Okay, so quite, okay. Quite funny that the uh, black has like six groups and white has like kind of like one, but still. Kind of black. one, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, but still yeah. white doesn't have, at the moment, doesn't seem to have any territory. <laughs> yeah, this game actually goes very funny. I probably should show that uh, from uh, the earlier. So earlier it was like, uh, yeah, in the opening it's like this. So white has a moya at the bottom, right? And in the game, black immediately you made here and take it away. So black has a living group. Oh. <laughs> Did Ilka play this? No, that was. <laughs> uh, <laughs> no, uh, this is this is a top pro game. This is from uh, Kise League A. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, and then white just to fix his shape and let black live. Oh. At this moment, when I check this game. I feel like, how can I possibly win this game? Because yeah, why is, you, when I watch those kind of Japanese game, normally if if that get my, my attention, one of the player is the one I support. I want him to win, and this game I want White to win. But at this moment, I ask myself, how can I possibly win this? I was very disappointed. Yeah. Okay, and then White just play the game. <laughs> we we know that this center there's supposed White is supposed not to make territory, and White just keep pushing. And then he just keep play the game, oh. and when black get the turn, I say this one is hopeless. And he just play here, and now okay, I understand he is actually making some moyo on the top, basically. Mm. Okay, and now that that's the last corner, white gave it. Uh -huh. So finally, white get a moyo on the top, right? White actually take play a lot of effort to get the moyo on the top, and the black come in. And white didn't do anything. But kind of just let it live. <laughs> Something very simple. But just simply let it live. 
Hmm. Yeah. And now, yeah, yeah, let's say black, not only black leave, you can see black actually get some point on the top side, right? Yeah. Yeah. M16, and like this, uh, M16 nice feeling killed Tomoyo. Yeah? yeah, that was, that was... Uh, and with this Atari, with this Atari, we know that on the top left corner, there's supposed to be a code normally in that kind of uh, shape. But white has the, black has a setting at C6, C19, so to get a connection on the first line. So that corner, there's also nothing. Hmm. Okay? And... Uh, Oh yeah, that uh, and when black uh, get, get the connection, black came out here, black also entered the center. Where's white territory? At this moment, actually, I feel it's hopeless. Even I feel it's hopeless. Yeah, but let's see how white just play normal and white has the enough points. Yeah. So in the game, yeah, white first just jump here. Hmm. Yeah. And so like this, then black white has totally no points in the center. I saw it. I saw it. Mm -hmm. Okay. And he put here. And he just play normal. He take he take the big stuff. Okay, and now he peep. And black say, I don't want you to, to get the uh, territory around Tengen area. Uh -huh. And then he come to squeeze. You can see here, see here, he squeeze. And uh, around those two moves, what has just played, he get a few points. Yeah. That's basically the boss. The boss <laughs> is functioning there and give you little money. Yeah. And uh, take that little money because that's only the first payment. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And now white honey and uh, black doesn't want white to have that part of territory. So white got this part of territory. Mm. So suddenly white has a lot of territory, right? Yeah. It's like suddenly, but actually white didn't do anything special. Yeah, black can probably prevent white to have this part of territory, but then white we're gonna have the other side the other side. For example, here if you for example do this connection, he connect here, he will go he will still have a lot of territory, it's just a transfer towards the center. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so here, yeah, like this. So suddenly he has a lot of territory there. Okay? Yeah, and black now save, save the two. Okay, and then in this area, yeah, white basically squeeze a little bit further. Yeah, so here he cut. Mm -hmm. And black need to answer here. Because if black doesn't answer there, white we're gonna get, get the other side, Kosumi Ah, uh, right. The second line, yeah. Kosumi yeah. yeah. So that is yeah. bigger. So well, yeah, black would rather let white get that benefit. Oh. So just a push. He's keeping pushing, keeps keeping squeezing here, all the way. Yeah, and then yeah, well, white add a move to come back here. Okay, and this one, this one is a, a, is a sign. I, actually, you know, because I'm just uh, watching the game. Uh -huh. This is not like my student game. If this is my student game, I'm gonna come all the time. Uh -huh. This is not my student game. This is just a pro game. So I basically just lay down here and relax and watching. And then this moment, do you remember earlier we were talking about C19? Yeah. And we say black are relying on C19, top left, left, left corner, there's no call. That is the southern year call, but this is a game. White is actually pretty strong everywhere, right? Mm -hmm. So even if it comes to southern year call, black need to be very careful because it can easily end up as black that corner is captured. Right. So when black play here, if black is still ahead, black will gonna add a move in the corner. Mm. So you know that here in the game, black capture, what does that mean? <laughs> hmm. So black already feel like he's losing the game. <laughs> Interesting. Yeah. So here, let's say you, you you can see when we when we come to this moment, we say, where's white territory? White doesn't have enough territory. Why do we gonna lose the game? And also for, from earlier, let's say we have talked about several situation. White has more deal, more black destroyed and black leave. And actually black leave kind of big like this. Yeah. And then finally white has a moyo there on the top. Black black invaded there and eventually. Let's say black leave kind of big by doing this. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, yeah, let's say it is as if white has failed everywhere. Yeah. But afterwards, once you squeeze the points out, did you notice it is not like you will not have enough. You you are desperate. It's just uh, those points. It doesn't look like it is big, or that there's some point you need to squeeze it out, and mm. it is not really visible. But yeah. once you squeeze. It does exist, so we can see as black attitude when black capture, so black is fighting for points already, and he basically allowed this corner to come to southern year call. Mm -hmm. And how this game end? That corner southern year call, what wins? I kill the corner. <laughs> because black has to fight four points, the black cannot really care about. I need to actually play use well. I need to limit by the cold threat. Black cannot do that anymore because black, yeah, otherwise black doesn't have enough. Right.
and one oh. might win the game uh, in the end. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. In the game, because we have one, actually, use the thousand year code to yeah. yeah to fill the corner. But actually, if Black is careful enough, I'm pretty sure Black is gonna accept. Okay, that corner is second. Mm, mm. Yeah, but Black just cannot be careful enough because he doesn't have enough. Mm. Mm. Who are the players? Uh, this uh, Black player probably is relatively famous. Uh, he's a relatively old player. Black player is always say. Eh? So the former oh, Kisi holder, yeah. yeah, and uh, white is the Yama, I suppose, and white is uh, Onishi Yohei. Mm. Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Auntie has actually talked to me about uh, yeah the, uh, a similar topic. You know what? Uh, sometimes Auntie tell, tell me something I don't completely understand until I see some pro game tell me the story. It sounds familiar. Auntie has talked to me some some similar story like that. I understand it better. Yeah, so what is the question yeah. there? Yeah, so yeah. what? You can live here. Yeah, so what? You can live here. Yeah, yeah so what? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah. yeah. So, yeah, let's say actually black live everywhere. It's like black, why the big territory is all gone there. But it doesn't matter. Let's say Moyo, the secret of Moyo or the secret of this kind of influences, you don't necessarily need to have anything big. Yeah, let's say if you keep a part of your territory as a part of your of your Moyo or influence, eventually come to territory, well, you're going to have enough. Because here the secret is actually pretty simple. When we say black has a lot of territory, he that a lot is just a few pieces everywhere, and each piece is not much. And because he has so many pieces, that means actually everywhere he actually needs to take care of it. That actually means that in you say, you increase, he doesn't. Yeah, in this kind of game, yeah, it is always the case. The one who taking your influence, if because you are strong everywhere, you don't need to worry. And then in the following of the game, you are the one that increase. And the opponent has so many stuff that he need to care about, he cannot increase anymore. Yeah, I was thinking the yeah. same that then Yoki, Yoki uh, Kesse, who is like the old champion, uh, he yeah. also had this kind of style that like uh, he had Moyo. You go and live there, and then he's like, so what? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Go, go somewhere else, and so what? And then the Moya is just like, like transforming somewhere else, and there is always points somewhere, and then then you finally lose. <laughs> oh yeah, I, I yeah, anti that word is is also good. If one of the player has well, has four corners white piece, because that kind of game normally it means nobody will gonna have anything too big, and that actually make the make the common number, let's say, very astonishing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, imagine, yeah, let's say, uh, yeah, we, we have given this kind of example before. In a game, both sides have over 100 points. Mm -hmm. For example, I have 110, uh, yeah, and you have 100. There, actually, as per percentage, I'm not leading by much. I mean, so for example, for example let's say my, I'm just leading by your 10%, right? Mm -hmm. I'm just leading by your 10% territory. Sorry, I mean, mm -hmm. okay? And let's imagine another e e extreme case here. Uh, I have 12 points, you have six. I'm double of you. You are only 50% of me, but we have both, we both have so little, you win. Oh. Yeah, you are 50% of me, but you win. Oh. Yeah, so here, when the, let, let's say, when the amount of territory for both sides is little, and then that six and a half will be very astonishing. Yeah, yeah so yeah, in this kind of game, when one side take all the four corners, that basically means that his territory, no, let's say no, nobody's territory will be too big, and then why the coming will be too big. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah, but okay. I guess that's pretty much everything I want to tell about the game. But yeah, here you can see from the two pro game example I have sh I have showed here, it's not as uh, as crazy as the uh, as the one I have showed from either my game or Oscar's game or Auntie's game. It's not it's not that crazy, but this kind of game requires patient. But before the patient, you need to have the belief. So I played at the outside. I have the influence. I don't have enough territory. It doesn't matter. I will have enough territory. You need to believe in it. You need to believe in it and then try it out, try to squeeze it. Mm -hmm. And you're going to have fun with it. I'm pretty sure you're going to have fun with it. Because actually that kind of game, you feel relaxed for, I don't have enough territory. The opponent has more. But I have nothing to worry about. He does. And the following of the game, only I can increase. And he need to worry about he cannot die as one. And two, 
he need to actually conserve all the balance of territory. He cannot let, let me just uh, get uh, get a lot out from the attacking. Otherwise, I win. Mean, he has a lot to worry about, and you know that you're going to increase. The only question is, will you increase enough? Mm. But in general, in general, you know that your number will going to go up. So let's say likely, likely in the end, if the opponent does something pretty well, it comes to a close game. Yeah. You, yeah, you, yeah, you just need to consider about, I have the support, I need to squeeze a little bit. You should never forget that. If you forget that, this kind of game, you'll, you'll be behind and you wouldn't have enough. Once you squeeze a little bit, at least, yeah, if things go normal, you'll get a close game. Oh. Yeah, and that is why you're supposed to have the belief on them. And this is something, uh, let's say from my, this example, I hope you understand. And I strongly encourage you to try it out because, yeah, recently I'm, I'm the one who is actually playing, playing influence in my game. I'm no longer taking territory. I in my game, as the, as the way anti normally is familiar with about the normal form of death. And I want to tell you, I'm having fun. Mm, nice. I'm having fun by playing like this and try it and have fun. Mm. That's what I want to say today. Okay. Yeah. Okay. But that's basically all what I want to say then. And uh, yeah, we are already very much over time. <laughs> yeah. 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 Thanks. And uh, uh, in two weeks, we are going to have uh, the sec second lecture and still around this time. Uh, we don't know who we're going to hold the lecture yet, right? Mm. Yeah, I guess we, yeah, I guess we don't know who we're going to hold the lecture, but it will be in two weeks, still on Saturday at 1, 1 p.m. healthy ah, time. And yeah, we do, we do. We so do? Who, oh. who, who is going to hold it? Yeah, who, uh, yeah, because I don't remember. <laughs> I don't Sorry, think we, we do. don't. Okay, yeah. I don't think we do. well, yeah, 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 yeah. In my mind, we only have decided today. I'm gonna hold this land director, and we don't have the following yet. We still need to ask about the yeah. Let's say, uh, ask them about who, who yeah, who want to hold the next the land the next lecture. Yeah. Yeah. But uh, yeah, let's say yeah, we uh, we're gonna meet you in two weeks, and there there will be another teacher who hold the lecture, and uh, yeah, let's say we're gonna have fun again. But before that. I hope you're gonna try out to try out to play influence and have fun. You will gonna experience that. Remember, you have some boss to rely on and squeeze it. That's the secret. Yeah, thank you. And uh, let's talk more in about two weeks. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Bye bye. Yeah, talk to you later then. See you.